What's up gamers, it's Fun Guy here. Today, I'm going to help you by explaining how to get better at hip fire. In Battlefield 1, hip fire is very effective if used correctly, and after this video, you are going to be fully prepared to dominate the battlefield. So please, smash that thumbs up button, and if you haven't subscribed already, click that button in the bottom right corner of the screen for more Battlefield content like this. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is optimize your settings. I have a video on this which I've linked above if you need a guide. Now that that's taken care of, we're going to need the correct weaponry. So aside from the MP18 trench, we've got the Automatico trench, not for the faint-hearted. We've got the Hellregal 1915 factory, a great choice there. The Ribby Roll 1918 factory. Probably said that wrong, but who cares? The name is funny. Another great choice, the Fedorov. Good medic class gun there. Now we've got the Madsen MG Trench. This one's probably the best machine gun choice. Bit of a demonstration of its effectiveness here. There we go. Next up we've got the Bar M1918 trench. Solid gun. Just a bit low on the magazine capacity. Now we have the Burton LMR trench. A good gun for the more experienced run and gun machine gunner. And now one for all you snipers out there, the Russian 1895 trench. This one is surprisingly good. A bit of the cowboy action with lever guns here. There we go. And then finally we've got the M1903 Experimental. Bit of a weird one, but it works surprisingly well. Of course this list isn't exhaustive, there are many more other guns you could put to use as well. So now let's talk a little bit about technique. Now obviously you can just aim at them and just hold the trigger down and that's the general result you'll get. Now a much better thing to do is to use control bursts because as you can see from the crosshairs the more you fire the wider your bullet spread gets so by using short little bursts you can get so much more out of your magazine as we'll demonstrate in just a second when our friend here's health recovers and there you have it still had half of my magazine left more or less and I got the kill and now probably the most important factor for survivability is movement and using cover. Now what I find works really well is you find a piece of cover and you just pop out either side of it, get a few shots on the enemy and then pop back in only to pop back up somewhere else. You can do this just with a simple left right strafe behind a wall or as I like to do use a hill like so, kind of move in like a crescent shape popping up in one spot getting down to maybe reload or get some cover for a moment coming back up in a different angle and shooting at the enemy again like so and there it is three steps to getting better at hip fire in battlefield one i hope you all find this helpful and i will see you in the next video either next sunday or in the live streams tuesdays and thursdays for now I'm going to leave you with a little outro, and I'll see you in the next video. Adios. Voglio munizioni!